You're listening to Apple FM. Apple FM. Find out more at applefm.co.uk. Broadcasting live from Musgrove Park Hospital on the ground floor of the Duchess Building. Online at applefm.co.uk. So now, as I mentioned, Apple FM are at the Somerset Duck Race today. And now, I believe, live on the phone, we can speak to Mr. Ross Marchant. Hello, Ross. Good morning, Darren. Good morning, how are you? Yeah, not too bad. Pretty cold, but Pretty... Uh, apart from that, it looks all really, good. It looks really sunny out there on the picture. It is. It's very sunny, but very cold at the same time. Very cold at the same time. Very do, deceptive. You, do you like the music I've chose for this? I love it. You love it? All the ducks are swimming in the water? Very apt indeed. Are they swimming yet? They're not yet, actually. No, they're not yet. It starts uh, at still, 11, is that still, right? We're still, yeah, 11 o'clock is the uh, due start time. Brilliant, brilliant. So, so describe the scene then, Ross. What's happening there? Let all the people, good people know about it. Well, okay, yeah, what's going on, basically, uh, it's uh, the Taunton Duck Race today. Uh, it's jointly organised by uh, the Cancer Research UK Committees of Bridgewater and Taunton. It's not real ducks. Just to clarify, it's plastic oh, ducks, like you shame. get in the bath. Um, they've all got a number. People can sponsor the ducks. Um, that's why they're recommended that you pay a pound, but obviously they'll take as much as you want to sponsor a duck for. Um, and uh, they're going to let them all go shortly, roughly around 11 o'clock, uh, and then they'll float down the River Tone, uh, and uh, whoever wins can win £100 is the top, top prize. 100 squid? Um, and obviously the, uh, the, the, the rest of the money... Uh, that's uh, raised here today goes to Cancer Research UK, so it's a great cause as well. A hundred quid for the winner? hundred pounds for the winner, That's yeah. not bad. So that's a nice incentive, isn't it, mate? Not bad. If you put a pound in and win a hundred, it's not can't be bad, can it? Could you put in a pound for me? I'll owe it no. you back. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's all done, to be honest. Oh, ah, no, um, no. I'll describe the scene for you. I'm stood in Gooden's Gardens at the moment, which is the starting point. Right. Um, opposite Lidl. Um, they're actually going to release the ducks from the bridge which goes across behind Debenhams. Yes. Um, they're standing at the moment, all the officials and the marshals are standing with great big bags full of ducks which are about to pour in all, all at the same time and then obviously they'll start uh, floating downstream to the finish line which is down outside the brew house uh, which is where our outside broadcast unit is as well. So if anyone's about today please do come down and uh, say hello. Our, 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 you'll see our outside broadcast unit. You can't miss us. Um, and we'll be pleased to see you down there. But obviously, uh, everyone will be heading that way anyway for the, the finish line. Yeah, it'd be fantastic. If you guys, whoever's listening, if you could head down there, that'd be fantastic. So show your support for the Duck Race for Cancer Research and for Apple FM, who are at the event this morning. So, Ross, you're going to be calling in all day. Is it just going to be you I'm going to be speaking to, or is it um, No, I'm sure Jason uh, will be uh, calling in as well, and Craig. We're all, we're all down here today. Um, Jason at the moment is PAing. Ooh. Amazingly, our PA system, our, our, cord- our uh, cordless microphone is working from Goodman's Garden and it's going right the way back to the brew house. So oh we, we're pretty, we're pretty stunned by uh, the range we've got <laughs> on our uh, on our microphone. So uh, Jason is here with me, but he's PAing and uh, that's been broadcast back to the finish line where uh, our answer broadcast unit is. Is he is he doing a good job? He's doing a good, great job, as ever. Uh, as ever. I've, I've had to dive under a tree, by the way. There's loads of seagulls circling overhead. <laughs> and a big poo has just missed me. I, I've heard. So <laughs> I've just, I just had to dive under a tree to get, in case, uh, oh, in case they're going to decorate me in a minute. I've heard, I've heard that if a seagull poos on you, it's good luck. So you might oh, win some it? money, yeah. Okay. Well, Mr. Hayes is just walking towards me as we speak. Okay. But, uh, we're, we're live on Apple FM. Please don't swear. Yeah, please don't swear. So what's going on down there, Jason? Basically, the ducks are about to be released. We're about 10 minutes away. There's loads of canoeists and everything to get the ducks out of the kind of reeds and the bank that they're going to get stuck into. And Craig has sponsored two ducks for oh. Apple FM. Oh, so oh. they're looking for first and second place prize money, hopefully. So they're not just they're not just for himself. He is going to share the prize money. No, apparently he's going to donate the money towards Apple FM and helping us to get on the airway. I, so. don't, I don't like the way you say apparently. Well... He's a long way away from us, <laughs> and we're kind of the start, so we can only take his word for it. All right. Well, guys, we'll speak to you later. Thanks very much for calling in, and we'll speak to you guys soon. We'll do. Okay. See take you care, later. everybody. Bye bye. Right. You're listening to Apple FM. Apple FM. So it is my pleasure to once again welcome on the line Mr. Ross Marchant, who is at this great Somerset Duck Race. Hello, Mr. Ross. Hello there. It's nice to know it's a pleasure to have me on your show. Do you know what? It is a pleasure. It's it's like <laughs> music you. mania and the weekend beat joining together in harmony. It's, it's like a, 
uh, weekend beat music mania mashup. Oh, that is. That's. <laughs> we need to do that for launch day. That's oh, fantastic. Yeah. So, Mr. Ross, describe to the good fellas and ladies at home and around what's going on. Well, it's underway now. Um, they launch on time uh, from the Bridge in Goodman's Garden. Uh, the flow of the river isn't, let's say it's not flowing very fast today, so they're making slow progress, but they've, uh, they've spread out a bit now, and there are, there are clear winners okay. um, uh, emerging. Okay. Uh, there's uh, a lot of people, and I mean hundreds and hundreds of people in Goodman's Gardens uh, nice. watching what's going on, uh, so it's a fantastic turnout for the event. Ross. Uh, and the sun is shining lovely now. Beautiful. Ross, how long yeah. is the actual course? Um, I say course. It's yeah, not, not I know really what you mean. Course. I would say about half a mile. Okay. okay. I'm guessing. Might be less, actually, but More importantly, I'm, not, I'm never that great at distances. No, neither me. More importantly, how's our ducks doing? The ducks are, are making their way down. They're, they're, they, like I said, they spread out. Like, obviously, when they threw them all in together, they're all bunched up, but they're, <laughs> they are spreading out now, and uh, a few clear winners are emerging. Can we get... Can, we, can somebody take a video? Because... I, I, I know it's I know it's a serious event and it's raising money for charity, but the idea of plastic ducks flowing down a river to me is is quite surreal. Uh, well, I have just uploaded a picture to the FM Apple FM Facebook page. Brilliant! Um, so you can see uh, what they look like when they started. Yes, search uh, Apple FM Taunton uh, for that, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely. Apple FM Taunton. And I will continue to uh, keep you abreast of things. Uh, in a pictorial uh, way. <laughs> Is that even a word? I don't know. I don't know. But your descriptions are fantastic. Thank you. No, I'm, I'm so cold. <laughs> <laughs> Is it really that cold? Well, I've taken my coat off because we're, we're branded up, you see, with our uniforms. Yes. I've taken my coat off so uh, uh, people can see uh, see my branding, so to speak. And... Uh, <laughs> It's, it's pretty nippy. <laughs> Nipply or nippy? <laughs> well, <laughs> bit of both. Moving on. <laughs> Moving on slightly. Um, <laughs> so, so the ducks, it's all going brilliantly. Uh, everyone's having a good time at the duck race thus far. Yeah, I'm still in Gooden's Guns at the moment. Uh, Craig Stone for Apple FM is on the main bridge uh, by the Coco nightclub. Right. Uh, and uh, Jason Hayes is now back at the finish line, back at our outside broadcast trailer, back at the finish line, uh, which is by the brew house. Um, I think he might be waiting there a little while, though, for a, a winner. <laughs> yeah, but he's got, he's got the best bit, because he's nice and warm. True. So he can just sit in the broadcast trailer. By the way... Yeah. Guys, fantastic work on that trailer. It looks wonderful. It does indeed, yeah. Once again, uh, there are pictures of it on the Facebook, on our Facebook page, so uh, if anyone listening wants to check it out, please do. Yes. Thank you very much, Ross. I shall speak to you soon. Yeah, we'll keep you posted. Yeah, thank you very much. Take care. Okay, bye bye. You're listening to Apple FM. Apple FM. We've had a phone call. It's Jason Hayes on the line. They're about to announce the winners of the duck race. Hello, Jason. Yes. Indeed, Darren. We're here at the. Um, Great Somerset Duck Race course in aid of Cancer Research UK. And we've had a slight technical hitch. Oh dear. What's the wrong? River, the river is flowing so fast, but the wind is pushing it in the other direction. <laughs> so the ducks started going back towards the start. <laughs> so we've had a few technical issues, right. but the organisers have decided to call it a day at Ooh. the furthest point. So we have three ducks, and the organisers are just scrambling now to find out the names of the three ducks that have won the race here in Taunton. So oh, hopefully wow. in a few minutes, we'll be able to tell you the winners. We're just looking, because there has been thousands and thousands of ducks released. The actual river tone turned yellow for a few minutes. I as know. The ducks I saw the river bridge. I saw the pictures on, on the Apple FM Taunton Facebook page. Unbelievable. I, I know, it's been unbelievable. Now, Craig is keeping his fingers, toes, and anything else he can cross, because he's hoping... Right, the winner of the Great Somerset Duck Race is Jan Walker from Taunton. She Woo! has picked the winning duck, and that has won first place here in Taunton. We're just looking for seconds now. Obviously, if she wants to donate it to Apple FM, that'd be nice. Oh, of course it would be, <laughs> yes. So £100 goes to Jan Walker for winning first place. We're just scrambling to see who's won second place now. Who's won second? I'm eagerly anticipating this. And second place goes to Laura Scribb from Burnham on Sea. Laura Scribb from Burnham on Sea. Well, well done to you too. Congratulations. We have one more prize. I believe there's three main prizes, so we're just waiting for the organisers. 
very technical this. You don't write your name on a duck. You have to look on the bottom side of the duck, <laughs> or, believe it or not, for the number to tally it across. So, so are, they, are they, like, trying to hook them out with big hooks? It, yeah, they've got basically a fishing net, and they're scooping them out as we speak. So these <laughs> were the first out of the river. There's, believe it or not, almost 10,000 to get out. So oh it's going to take a few minutes. So if you're going into Taunton Town Centre and you wonder why these people are skipping ducks out of the river tone, yeah. then that's what they're still doing. If you're, if you're not used to Taunton and, and you're looking at the river tone, you're thinking, what the, what the hell's going on there? Just loads of yellow ducks in the water. There is, indeed. So, the third place goes to Nick Marsh. Nick Marsh. From Taunton. Well done. So, so what, what does second and third win if, uh, if first wins £100? I think I think first place was £100, second place was 50 and third place was £25 in the Great Somerset that race. Nice, nice. Hey, you're probably going to get sick of this noise, but i got something to play you. What's that? Okay. Hold on. This is, this is in keeping with the ducks, okay? Okay. <coughs> Great. Has there been a lot of that going on? There has been so many duck race and kind of duck jokes. <laughs> Craig apparently has gone crackers. Crackers, not quackers. Cra well, I think it's both, really. We knew about that ages ago. Well, we did, yeah. We must thank, of course, uh, Council Research UK and the Great Somerset Duck Race for inviting us along. It's been a great day down here in Taunton. There's a lot still going on. The stalls are still open. So if you're heading your way into the town centre, then make your way down. Great charity to come and support if you... Um, if you want to uh, give any money to Council Research. Yeah, yeah, it'd be brilliant. Uh, are you guys going to be calling me up later on as well with some interviews? No. I think we might do. We're going to try and find a few of the organisers and we'll see if we can put them on the line for you to do some interviews. Brilliant. Yeah, hopefully in the next few minutes we'll be coming back with some of the organisers, of uh, course, from this great race. OK then, mate. Well, take care. Thanks for doing that. OK, we'll see you later, Dan. See you later. Jason Hayes there at the Great Somerset Duck Race. It sounds fantastic, to be honest with you. You're listening to Apple FM. Apple FM. On the line, joining us now, we should have Vanessa Brooks, who is the organiser of the Duck Race. Vanessa, are you there? Hello there. Hello, Vanessa. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good, Very good. Excited. So, tell us, tell us more about the Duck Race, what it involves and what the cause is. Okay, well, we're raising money for Cancer Research UK. Yep. And we are, or have done already, released 10,000 yellow plastic bath ducks into the River Tone in Taunton. Brilliant. Brilliant. And each duck is being sold for £1. Yep. People can still donate money if they'd like to, that's not a problem. Nice one. If you have a winner now, that's fine. Um, but they can always donate to our cause. Wonderful, wonderful. I've seen the pictures um, on our Facebook page, Apple FM Taunton, and uh, it's just an amazing sight. Just hundreds, hundreds of plastic yellow ducks flying down the river. It's just unbelievable that so many people get involved with this. Oh, it certainly has done. We've got a huge army of volunteers, committee members, um, oh, like wonderful people that have been helping us today, Marsha Lynch and John Van Bellen. The, the guys on the river as well from the Taunton Canoe Club, they've just been marvellous. So, now the actual race has finished, what else, if people are heading down now, perhaps they've missed the race, unfortunately, what else can they look forward to for the rest of the day there? Well, we've still got our gazebos up with um, hooker ducks for the children, we've got um, the spinner wheel of fortune, we've got a little stool there selling some lovely jewellery, we've got some tombola prizes, and there's music, of course, which is brilliant. Nice, nice. So, the rest of the day, still loads and loads of activities. Is the weather looking like it's going to hold out? It certainly is. We've had a good forecast, six degrees, for the fairly sunny, a little bit windy, but it seems to be fine. Nice, nice. Well, thank you very much, Vanessa, for speaking to us this morning. It thank is you. a fantastic cause, uh, well worthwhile, and we've, it, we've, uh, I can speak for the guys that are there. We've absolutely had a blast uh, bringing uh, coverage well, from it. Do please send your listeners to the um, website. Sure. So they can still donate, which is www.greatsomersetduckrace.co.uk. There you go, you've had it. www.greatsomersetduckrace.co.uk. You can still give money now. Plenty, plenty reason to still give money. Well, thank you very much, Vanessa. Take That's care. A pleasure. Thank and you very thank much. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Okay, bye bye. You're listening to Apple FM. Apple FM. Hello, Mr. Jason Hayes. Hello, Darren. Are you all right? So, who is the final interview? Uh, I must admit, it's one of the organisers who is... Wonderful. 
Dawn Harris, and he's going to have a chat with you. That's Dawn okay. Harris, Harrison. brilliant. Uh, Harrison. Dawn Harrison. Sorry. Yes, she's been here for cancer research and the Great Duck Race. So I'm going to hand you over and she's going to have a few words with you. Thank you now very much. I'm going to in the studio for you. Hello, Dawn. How are you? Uh, very well, thank you. Good, good. How is today looking then? I believe it went down a storm. It did. It was absolutely fantastic. The me- people from Taunton have been wonderful. They've just, they've just uh, come down and helped us, and they've just been incredible. The amount of money that they've raised for us is brilliant. Fantastic. So, uh, give us a little summary of what the Great uh, Somerset Duck Race is all about, what has been going on today, and why it's such a great and massively worthy cause. Yes. Um, the Great Somerset Duck Race was organised by two volunteer committees that raise funds throughout the year for Cancer Research UK, and that's the Bridgewater Friends and the Taunton Committee, and they decided that they wanted to do uh, the Great Somerset Duck Race on Easter Sunday to raise funds for Cancer Research UK. Wonderful, wonderful. So how much do you believe that the duck race has raised thus far? Well, we think it's raised um, anything from 5000 to 10000 so wow. far. Wow. Which is a phenomenal amount. It's wow. Yeah, it really is fantastic. That's unbelievable. Amount. I'm sitting yeah. here in the studio on my own, but I'm going to give a round of applause there. I know it doesn't sound like much, but, you oh. know, that's a fantastic um, achievement. It is. I mean, considering it's mostly from £1 donations that individual people have come down and sponsored a duck and, and previously sponsored a duck, we have got had a few larger donations, £50 donations and £100 donations from corporate sponsors that yeah. have actually sponsored the duck race, but mostly it's from individual people that have come down here today. This is exactly why um, I'm proud to be from Somerset and living ah, in Somerset, because yes. we are amazing when it comes to fundraising and things like that, aren't we? Oh, we are. I mean, Somerset is, it, they, they're incredible people, they're so passionate and they're so dedicated in their support as well to us. And, and the people that support us all the time and people that have just come down here for the day they've been just so generous they are fantastic people so for people who maybe missed the actual race yes. what else is going on what what else is happening there for the good people who might well, be coming down there we've got um, a big tombola we've got some um, spinner wheel um, competition we've got another um, like the old-fashioned uh, hammer on the uh, on the end of a oh I know yeah uh, like, yeah, a, like the got, strongman test that's the have one have you yeah. done the strongman test no not yet not yet oh. I think I'm going to have to though <laughs> <laughs> get get Jason Hayes on the strongman test as well yeah. and all the other Apple FM guys we'll definitely get Jason on the strongman I test I want some definitely. pictures I want some pictures <laughs> I want to see proof <laughs> yeah we'll, we'll get you pictures we'll get you pictures brilliant brilliant <laughs> well have a lovely day. Uh, take yes. care, and hopefully we'll speak to you soon. We will do, and thank you. And could I just say thank you so much to everybody in Taunton and surrounding areas for coming along and supporting this fantastic event today, and for all the money that they've raised for Cancer Research UK. And if people still want to raise and, and donate a little bit of money to us, if they, they can go on to the www.com greatsomersetduckrace.co.uk uh, website and they can still make a donation to Excellent. Us. So www.greatsomersetduckrace.co.uk if you still yes. want to get involved perhaps you can't make it down there but you want to give some money greatsomersetduckrace.co.uk is the place to go to do that. Yes it is. Thank you very much Dawn. I shall speak to you soon. Take care. L- lovely. Thank you. And have a great rest of the day. Thanks we a lot. We will do. Cheers. Bye bye. You're listening to Apple FM. Apple FM. Find out more at applefm.co.uk.